Hi, I'm Bill McLaughlin, Editor-in-Chief of Furniture Today. Welcome to this week's edition of Frontline Friday. We're here in High Point getting ready for the Klausner at Market Hour on Fox 8 WGHP and for Furniture Today's live spots. We hope you'll tune in and join us. My guests this, this week are Jim Hines, President and General Manager of Fox 8 WGHP, and Len Burke, Vice President of Marketing with Klausner. Jim, tell us a little bit about how this came to be, this uh, program and your affiliation with the market. Well, Bill, thanks. Um, several years ago, uh, we were looking for an opportunity for a way to, to understand the market and, and be able to explain uh, to our two million viewers in the triad the impact of the market, not only here in High Point, but to the tens of thousands of people who, who obviously make their living still in the furniture business. We have a great heritage in this area, certainly with furniture and textiles. And just about that time, Bill Wittenberg and the good folks at Klossner reached out to us, and we were able to form what we think is a, a great collaboration and a partnership to be able to tell this story. Len, can you share with us uh, some of the details about how this came about from Klausner's perspective and how it's evolved over the years? Well, we moved here in uh, April of 2011 from our showroom in Ashborough. And we felt that there was a void in the in the market for getting news and information uh, out to the out to the market goers and the public, and so we partnered with our friends at Fox and secured airtime on Saturday and Sunday morning, 30 minutes, and which is a prime time for for market goers to be watching uh, as they get ready to come to the market. And uh, we produced two shows. Uh, after the second show, we had had tremendous response, so we uh, decided to take it to an hour. Uh, we partner with our friends at Furniture Today to bring the live segment of it, and today we are covering a very wide spectrum of the market uh, with news and information. And I think this upcoming show really speaks for that. For the for the for the guests that we have on, uh, it really is a very informative show. Speaking of the guests uh, that we have on, uh, can you give us a little preview of who people can expect to see? Yeah, we have uh, Jeff Childs, who is now the new president of the uh, NFA Association, which is one of the largest associations that represents retailers around the country. He's given information about, uh, very, very valuable information about the organization. We have Steve Riley with the Nebraska Furniture Mart, who is giving us his industry expert on, on buying habits and trends that he's seeing in the marketplace. Uh, of course, we've got Trisha Yearwood, who will be giving us a, an interview and an introduction of her new collection, along amongst with a lot of other guests. And Furniture Today's Dave Perry. That's right. <laughs> we can't forget him. <laughs> so, Jim, you've gotten to see this evolve a little bit at Fox. Uh, what is Fox's perspective on the value that this brings and, and where this might go? Well, all of us at WGHP, as, as we talked about before, the, the importance to all of our viewers, as well as the, the, the folks that come from all over the world right here at the market. Um, we, we use certainly our on-air on -air assets and tremendous digital assets to be able to communicate to the folks that are here, as well as you know the, the other two million viewers that realize that, that this is really a part in the fabric of our of our of our community. Thank you very much for your time. It's a pleasure. We'll see you soon. I'm Bill McLaughlin with Furniture Today. We'll see you at market.